get a value x given the z-score population standard deviation and population mean so we're lucky if we have x data value formula is given in other words it's been isolated already x is equal to population mean plus z-score times standard deviation so we're lucky we can just plug it in if z-score is given we just plug in here population standard deviation plug in here and population mean you just plug in here and do a little arithmetic your answer is there okay now if we are not lucky we are not given this then of course which formula we're going to use so of course z score so z score is equal to x minus a data point minus the population mean over standard deviation so all we do we just this is a fraction we just have over one or it just multiply by standard deviation in both sides there is <clears throat> plenty of oil you can do that actually so I'm gonna just actually uh, cross multiply here I think many of you will go with the cross multiplication so I'm gonna put one over here and one times this down here is gonna give me same thing x minus the population mean equal to and Sigma times the Z score which is Z times Sigma and obviously I need to go over go isolate the X by itself because this is what I'm looking for X value data point so I'm gonna isolate so I'm gonna add mean in both side I'm gonna add mean in both side so add population mean in both side so this is gonna get cancelled I have X is equal to population mean plus z standard deviation z times the standard deviation so look this formula and exactly this formula this formula and that one is exactly the same thing okay let's take a look into this in example so find the x value given mean equal to 65 standard deviation is 15 and z score is 2.75 already know that x is equal to population mean plus z times the standard deviation all we do we just plug it in so the mean is in this case is 65 mean is 65 plus standard deviation so z score is 2.75 2.75 times the standard deviation which is 15 and if I do this little arithmetic I did ahead of time, it gives me 106.25. And what is that? This is a data point. So this is the answer you find. And any different numbers giving you an ask for data point or data value, this is a z-score formula you're using. And of course, if we are lucky, we will be given data value formula. So directly we just substitute and get the answers. Thank you.